Get ready to sculpt and strengthen your upper body today. We're about to do a 30 minute workout targeting your arms, abs, chest, and back. So you will need a medium set of dumbbells. I'll be using two 10 pound weights. And as an option, you could also grab a heavier set of weights for your chest and back exercises. I'll be using two 15 pound dumbbells for those ones. I'll also be using a bench for one of the movements. You could use a chair or a coffee table as well. I've included a quick warm up and cool down for a complete routine. So gather your equipment and get ready to sculpt. All right, first move in our warm up is reach and pull. Really resist as you draw the elbows back. Here we go, 20 seconds per move for our warm up today. Stay here, rotate those arms up, rotate down. Good, shoulder rotation. Into twist. And neck tilt side to side. Good, nice and gentle. And warm up those wrists. Fingers down, fingers up, palms forward. Circle those arms. All right, warm up complete. Let's grab your medium set of dumbbells. So my two 10 pound weights and we have alternating single narrow press to start off. Here we go, 45 seconds on, 15 seconds off. Good, bracing through that core, working through the shoulders. Beautiful. Okay, take a breather. Next movement, we have bent arm lateral raises, two here, then dumbbells together, press it forward. Here we go. Good. Exhale, lift, inhale, lower, then press forward, bring it back in. Good, keep those elbows lifted. Don't let them droop for those lateral raises. All right, you are leaning forward, bending through those knees. We have two tricep extensions, then two bent arm flies right there. 
So working the triceps, then working the back of the shoulders for those flies. Keep the elbows back, tricep extensions, squeeze those shoulder blades. Good, find that control. Dumbbells together for our overhead triceps, four reps, then row it back. So you're drawing those elbows back, row it, then dumbbells together back overhead, repeat. Good, feeling the burn through those triceps. Let's go. Okay, drop one of your dumbbells. And we have press overhead, then chop and twist. Press overhead, chop and twist. You're engaging that core the whole time. Got a bit of standing core work. So press, twist and chop. Good. Engage the core. Demo is into the right hand for the next move, and we have bicep curls, single arm, four regular bicep curls, palm up, and then four hammer curl, just like that. Here we go. So other arm can be out to the side, or it can be on your hip. If you have it out to the side, you're gonna start to feel the burn in those shoulders. Woo. Good. Four hammer curl, four regular for those biceps. Switch hands. Now you're doing bicep curls on with your left hand. Four palm faces up, four hammer curl, palm faces in. Okay. Grab your other dumbbell and we have uh, wide bicep curls. One, two, then on the third one, 
you can do a little bonus press out for a challenge there. Let's go, palms face up. Two, three, pulse out. Ooh, that's tough. Those arms are burning. Good, we are going to the floor after this. Taking a break from our standing exercises. Good, and getting ready to work the chest muscles. Okay, I'm gonna switch the dumbbells out and grab the heavier set because we're gonna do chest press. So you have that option there to grab the heavier set of dumbbells, come onto your back. Take those elbows wide, bent to the side, and then press. Inhale to bend, exhale to press. Good. All right, next movement, bringing those dumbbells together. Bend and stretch. So narrow press, dumbbells together. Let's go. All right. I'm gonna switch out my dumbbells, dropping those heavier weights, grabbing one of the medium set of dumbbells, one of these 10 pound weights, and we have pullovers. Join in when you're ready, pulling over, and then crunch knee lift. Alternate legs. Good, keeping those elbows bent and shoulders pressed down and away from the ears for that pullover. Lift the upper body to the sky, work the core. All right, next move, dumbbells to the sky. We have leg lowers. Lower, hover off the ground, then come back up. Modify if needed. Without that dumbbell, you can have the arms by your side or even keep the knees bent. Let's go. Good. Good, pulling that belly button into the spine and lower back into the ground. Come up part way with that dumbbell. We have twist, then press forward, twist, 
press forward, you're leaning back so you can get that core activation. All right, lean back, press, twist, press. Good. Draw your attention to your posture. Shoulders down and back, length and long. Get rid of that dumbbell. We're doing side planks, super fun, coming onto your right elbow. Stacked or staggered legs, crunch, hip dip. Let's go modify if needed by dropping that bottom knee. Good, push through, I know it's tough. Let's do this, 15 seconds. Switch sides, come onto your other elbow, should be your left elbow, same thing. Let's do it all over again. Good, feet are stacked or staggered. Here we go. Do the best you can. All right, flip around, tricep dips, knee lift. Bend and stretch, knee lift. Ooh. Getting those wrists ready. Okay. Okay, stand on up. I'm gonna grab one of my heavier dumbbells and use the bench. We're gonna do rows with the right arm. So bend over, row it back with the right arm. Here we go. Good, so soften through the knees, flatten the back. Squeeze and hold as you row it back. And then release, nice and slow. Working those back muscles. Okay, switch sides, dumbbells into the left hand. Same thing with those rows. Here 
Here we go. Hold and squeeze. And slowly extend. Squeeze. Good. All right, option to switch those dumbbells out for the medium set. And we have wide shoulder press. Let's go. Good, if you wanna add a challenge, then just do a little pulse, then press. Pulse, then press, nice. Okay, two hammer curls for the next move, then two lateral raises. So palms are facing in for the hammer curls, then soften through the elbows and keep them lifted and supported for those lateral raises. Okay, those lateral raises should never be directly to the side. They should be slightly forward for a better positioning on those shoulders. Okay, uh, wide curl, so palms are facing up. Curl, then knee lift, curl, knee lift, other side. All right. Okay, we're feeling it on those biceps. We're in the final third of our workout. So now is when you're really gonna start. Your muscles are really gonna start to fatigue with these exercises. Revisiting those muscles a second time round. All right, revisiting those triceps. Single, single, double extension. Okay, elbows back, really breathe through it. Exhale, inhale. Come on to your back, bring those dumbbells with you. For skull crushers. So palms are facing your legs, dumbbells together, bend and extend. 
here we go. Elbows stay about shoulder width here. Good, again, we're working the triceps. Okay, palms face in, we have flies. So soften through the elbows, take it to the side, and back up. Shoulders down, shoulder blades together. Okay. Come up part way with those dumbbells. You're gonna lean back and do alternating bicep curls, palms face up. Okay, here we go. Good, this one can be tough. You're working the core, working those biceps at the same time. Good. The more you lean back, the harder this one gets. those dumbbells come onto your back let's work the core we have bicycle twists good taking it at a slower pace so we can really control it here we go Okay, sit up, all the way up. Option to lift those legs, do a boat hover, lower them, and then come back down. Here we go, peel off the ground, lift and hold, draw those knees in towards you, lower, back down. Good, so close. You have one movement after this. Woo. Grabbing those heavier dumbbells, if you'd like to challenge yourself for this final move. And we have Renegade Rose. Row it, row it, hands off, off, on, 
on. Let's go drop those knees if you need to. Good, but let's push ourselves. This is the last move here. Hands off, off on the outside of those dumbbells, back on. Good, keep those hips square. Avoid rocking them side to side. Good, don't let those hips creep up to the sky. Keep that flat plank. You did it. Get rid of those dumbbells and let's cool down. Find a child's pose, knees together or apart, reaching forward. Relax that forehead to the ground. Breathe it out. Come on to hands and knees, reach the right arm up and thread it through twist. Unravel, other side, left arm up, thread it through twist. Okay, unravel, let's stand on up and do some tricep stretches with the right arm overhead. Use that other hand to pull the elbow back. Good. And switch arms, left arm overhead. Good, if you have a wall nearby, let's do chest stretch with your right arm first, bend that elbow, then twist away from the wall. Here we go. Good, twist away from the wall until you feel that stretch through your chest. Switch arms, press it against the wall, twist away. All right, back to center, two final breaths together. Inhale, reach up. Exhale. Last one, reach up. Exhale. Amazing work today, everyone. You did it. All right, if you felt the burn, then hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and comment below to let me know if you want to see more 30-minute upper body workouts similar to this. See you in the next one.